Well, hi, Jen and Sylvia Soska. How are you? We're wonderful. How are you? I am so wonderful. I want to thank you for joining me here on the Valder BB Show, broadcasting live from Dallas, Texas, on a global platform. Oh, thank you so much for having us. We love Dallas, Texas. Well, you guys are twins. I read that. I thought you were just sisters, but now I know that you're twins. <laughs> you're going to tell me about Elevator. Tell me about Elevator, because I'm scared just reading the promo, okay? <laughs> Valder, I think you would do fine. What we do is we take a group of three friends and we put them in our elevator. And then individually they have to go and tackle frights in three different floors. If they survive the first three floors, they go to the very bottom bonus level, which is the labyrinth, which is essentially the scariest thing they'll ever have to deal with. Okay, so who came up with the idea? Is it a show that was already created for you guys, or did you guys go to somebody and pitch it and say, look, hey, we could scare the bejesus out of everybody? It came from Blumhouse and GSN, and we actually read the press release months before we came onto the show and thought, oh, my God, I really want that job. <laughs> <laughs> I already knew it was going to be our, for our favorite show. Oh, yeah, whether we were involved in it or not. And then we, we campaigned pretty hard to be sitting in these chairs, and in these chairs we now sit. <laughs> well, you guys did a good job of, of getting the job, and you're working with some incredible directors. Uh, tell me about the kind of uh, scenes powerhouse people you have behind you. Well, we have Jason Blum, who is pretty much at the top of the game in the horror genre. He's been making these amazing high-concept films that just everybody sees. If there's a Blumhouse film in theaters, everybody's going to see it, and everyone wonders how he does it. But he just really has a passion for horror and an eye for talent. And GSN, when you talk about creating challenges that are interesting, unique, and fresh every week, it's just so amazing to be able to be teaming with them. And they, they were just fantastic in creating these things. There are so many unique challenges on this show. There's even one where, I don't want to scare you, but this woman had this glass mask on her head, and every 30 seconds a rat would drop in there, and she had to run through a maze, which... She, well, I can't tell you whether she got $10,000 or not for doing it, but man, was it a heck of a show. Oh, it was a great show for us. <laughs> okay, I'm over here holding on to my desk. Okay, <laughs> <let me ask. laughs> okay, so let me ask you, tell me about this $50,000 that they can win if they make it through. How, how do they get that? Well, they get different cash amounts for every challenge they complete. The first challenge is $5,000, the second challenge is ten. dollars the third is $15,000, and if they survive those three levels, whoever survives gets an opportunity to maybe even double their weddings, winnings and get $20,000 in the labyrinth. And you have to remember that every episode is a unique kind of a interactive horror movie experience, and the money doesn't belong to the contestants. There's characters that own the money, so they're not very willing to part with it. This is so exciting. And so you're launching it because it's Halloween. That's why it's a good launch date. It's a great launch date. We tried for Christmas and they said no. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you guys are twins, but you guys have had a, a pretty stellar career prior to coming to the Game Show Network. Tell me a little bit about what you did that people saw you to get you here. Well, we're formerly failed actresses, but now successful actresses. Mm -hmm. And we're also writer, producers, and directors of our own films. Our first film um, is a grindhouse throwback. It was called Dead Hooker in a Trunk. Our second film was a medical horror film that I think really broke us called American Mary. It was about a, a female working in the medical profession, and uh, things just go very bad for her. It's on Netflix. I think you would love it. It's a very, a very fun horror movie. And then uh, we worked with Lionsgate and the WWE, and we made uh, See No Evil 2, and then we made Vendetta, and then we also had a segment in the ABCs of Death 2. We're, we're kind of like filmmaking sharks. If, if we ever stop making films, I think we're afraid we'll die, so we try and do one every year. And that's why we love Elevator so much. It's a different story every week, so it's like we're directing a mini Blumhouse horror movie once a week. For an audience of three. <laughs> a captive audience of three. Oh, I like that. <laughs> well, you guys are going to be captivating people every week. I love the concept. I love what you're bringing to the Game Show Network. And let me ask you, when am I going to be watching you guys? 
You're going to be watching us Wednesday as the premiere is October 21st, this Wednesday, 8 p.m. Eastern Time, 7 p.m. Uh, Central Time. And then we're going to be every Wednesday after that on GSN. Once again, how can my audience, if they want to be as famous as you guys and be participants, can they do that? Absolutely. You can go on GSN.com and you can go under the Elevator section and you can apply on you need is two other willing friends and a good attitude. <laughs> <laughs> Jen and Sylvia Soska, you guys have been a delight, and I know Elevator is going to be so much fun. Thank you so very much for coming on my show. I can't wait to watch you. Oh, oh thank, thank you, you so much, and happy Halloween. Thank you, and I, happy Halloween to you also.